We can definitely buy at least one of the two, uh, one of the two gadgets left here. What do we got? Oh, that's so good. Uh, give me the reduction bomb. And then we've almost got enough for Thief Reflexes, so we actually got a lot more money there than I expected in that run. That's really good. What are your abilities right now? Oh, we have the Guttural Roar now. Give me that. And I still want Turnbuckle, yeah. I love the noise Murray makes. Bam, ba, bam, bam. All right, Murray, let's do this. Rumor has it that several off-duty guards meet in that cabin for an RC combat. This is going to be great. I haven't been in any RC combat since that job we pulled in Istanbul. It was awesome. Eli, thank you for following. Hope you enjoy the stream and the future ones you come to. Sorry that the alert kind of went over the audio for a bit there, but hey, subtitles, that's what they're there for. This is not the bear leading one. This is the RC battle one. That guy did not die because of unfortunate placement, but it's fine because goodbye. Those guards will never let you into the combat club without a disguise. That old moosehead should do the trick. Only there's no way for you to get up there. Hide out in this barrel while I send in Sly to steal the head. Yeah, sure. Sly, if you can get the stuffed moose head without being detected, Murray should be able to join the RC Combat Club without raising any suspicion. Really? You think that moose head is all it'll take? Look at this. Do you see this? How's it going, bud? How you doing there? What's up, Murray? How's it been hanging? Can I get in there too? There's enough room for two in there? Amazing. Welcome to stream. Good to see you. How you doing? I want this. Come on. There we go. Nice. What level are we on? Uh, this is episode seven, I assume is what you mean. Where's my point of ascension? I don't remember where you're supposed to, uh... Oh, is there a... Wait a minute, I think I see it right there. This is episode seven of eight. Oh, no, you don't. Yeah, there it is. That's what I'm looking for. Up we go, Sly. Is that my boy Slyro in chat? Sly, what is happening, man? It's been a hot second. You missed, like, a stream or two. You coward. How dare you? Murray can... Oh, I didn't realize I wasn't allowed to kill anyone. But, uh... Murray can fit into any size object he needs to. Wait, Murray's gone. He... Was he ever even there to begin with? He no longer exists. He was in that barrel just a moment ago, but now he's... He's vanished. He made himself so small, he stopped existing. Oh, no, you don't. My nephew was home for the past week, so I didn't have enough free time. How dare you have your nephew visit? Unacceptable. Well, all that matters is that you're here for what is going to be the finale of Sly 2 Band of Thieves. Because we're going to finish it today. And then hopefully you can make some of the Sly 3 streams. Look at that go. Ranger Gold, welcome to stream. Uh, you haven't missed much. We did the first two missions of Episode 7. Now we're doing the third one. What on earth is this? What is this for? What does this accomplish? What does this do? Who built that and why? Uh, hello, my spire jump didn't proc, but also I'm amazing at the video game. Ooh, okay, that's a little bit more... I need you to like, nod off a little bit. Nice. This level looks really cool. I do really like episode seven and its levels. Yo, large gold bar. I think that's worth even more than a ruby. It's really good. Episode six and seven are ice worlds and are based on like uh, in Canada and like logging companies and stuff like that. Cause that's what Jean Basson does is like destroy forests. It is really, really good. 
IML. Two of my favorite episodes. I love the designs. Murray is like not down there. Murray, heads up. How did he not hear you say that? Hey fellas, any of you guys think you can beat the mur the, the moose? Maybe put a bet on it. Oh, I'm in, eh? I ain't got a lot of money for this wager, but there's no way I'd lose to a new guy like you, huh? <laughs> what a horrible idea, you stupid idiot. That RC combat drone takes some skill to control. Oh, no. Steer with the left analog stick and hold down the X button for gas. After you collect the fallen ammo, press the square button to fire its turret. Here's a pro tip. You can only aim the turret while you're stopped. What do I... Oh, I have to press... I, okay, I understand. Not... A huge fan of this. It's not the greatest design little mini game in the world, but it's not terrible. Do you not have to pick up ammo too, you coward? That's not fair. Give your boy more ammo. Yo, I need. <laughs> oh my word, these controls. Stop this. Where's my flamethrower? Hey, don't mind me. I'm just gonna like. <laughs> these. <laughs> the camera angles. <laughs> No, the camera angles, though. Ah! I only have one bullet. I need more than one, but no! How did they fall for this moose head? I, I cannot grab that to save my life. Well, I got, like, a hit there. Hey, don't mind me. Just, no! The controls! Ah! Oh, good. I think I won. But I ain't got no money. That might be okay. It all depends. Depends on what? On whether or not you know the location of the Northern Light Battery. Oh well, I guess I owe ya. What? What is this? He just asked a question that is very like, oh, why would someone else who works this job want to know that information? Why would you answer that instead of report it to Jean? After reading through the log shopping guide, it's become painfully clear that to win in the Lumberjack games, we'll have to cheat. Now, I've constructed a plan that hinges around us acquiring an eagle's egg, which is more difficult than you'd think. First, Murray needs to lure a bear into taking out the local oil mains. Once destroyed, the pressurized oil should ignite and create updrafts, which Sly will then use to paraglide over to the eagle's nest. Grab an egg, and then head back to the safe house. Thanks to Murray's undercover work in the RC Combat Club, we've learned that the Northern Light Battery is hidden in a silo nearby. The battery needs some serious modification if we're going to hide inside it to sneak onto Arpeggio's blimp. First, we'll short the battery with grapple lines on local boats. Then, we'll all break into the lighthouse and sever the power flow to the battery. That way it won't recharge. Given my electrical engineering background, this plan has a 97% chance of success. Pretty good, huh? How did you get that picture of Sly being electrified? Where did that come from? Are they having an RC fight while on the job? Is that is that not what you do when you're on the job? Have I been doing it wrong all this time? I love Boat Hack. I love that mission. It's one of my favorite missions in the game, personally. Because it, it's a hacking mission, and also you get to shoot the grappling hook, which is always fun. Especially, it was especially fun to, like, eight-year-old me. Eight-year-old me loved it. I love it now, but eight-year-old me loved it more than he should have. If we're gonna get an eagle egg, you'll first have to destroy all the local oil mains. It looks pretty sturdy. The Murray is strong, but his fists can't punch through metal. No problem. See that old bear down there? His name is Grizzleface. The guards ignore him because he's blind and practically nerve dead, except for his sense of smell. If that old guy smells fish, there's no stopping him. Use Grizzleface to take out the oil mains. But I don't smell like fish, do I? How can I lure him around? Bentley's taken up a post along the river. He 
You'll keep tossing bombs into the water, and the fish should get blown sky high. Plenty should land near your position. So totally. You want me to throw a fish at the oil main so that old grizzle face will knock him apart? That's the idea. You might even try throwing fish at the guards. Might improve their odor. How does that work? Bentley, how did you... How? Yo, Grizzleface, what's up? Look what I got, buddy. I don't know why you're not trying to, like, kill me for it, but yo, go get that. Tear that asunder. Yeah, there you go. Oh, that's super dead. Nice work. Yo, Bentley. Trot old Grizzleface over to the next oil main by luring him with fish. What's happening, Grizzleface? How you doing? Let's go over to this one next, buddy. Hey, get that fool. Go get him. Eat up. Yeah, tear him asunder. Get him. Get him. Get him. Oh, he's he's gone. He's gone. How'd you live a hit from that? All right, goodbye. Bentley. Oh, thank you. Thank you, magical sky turtle. How am I gonna... You know what? If I remember right, I think the game will make it happen. Come on. Grizzleface is moving towards your position. Oh, I bet Grizzleface is. Alright, chat, now we just wait. Now we just wait. Now, how's everyone in chat doing? How are you guys doing today? That bear can run pretty fast. He's on the way. Yeah, he is. Hey, don't see me. I'm a little busy right now. He'll be here soon, I'm sure. Bear's coming. Is is the bear coming? Do we have like an ETA? Any day now. Any uh any any day now. Oh, there he is. Hey, bud, how's it going? Don't mind me. Get that. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Love that bear. You go away. Where's my where's my next fish? Bentley, please. Yes. I have been blessed with the fish. Got one over there and one over there. I think I want to go to this one next. Actually, it looks like I probably should have gone to this one second, to be Sensors honest. In the safe house indicate that Grizzleface is on the move. Uh, what are these nerds doing here? They're in the way. Where's the bear loading bar? What do I plan on streaming tomorrow? Probably Hyrule Warriors. What's up, buddy? Yo, kill those fools? Oh, my word. That's one mad bear. Yo, who put that there? Goodbye. Hey, get that, would you? Excellent. All right, well, I'm going to need another fish, first of all. Where, uh, thank you. Now we're going to have to get all the way over there. Hey, Bentley, how's it going, man? I guess that that enemy right there just doesn't care about you. I thought I heard a bottle for a second there. Oh, I absolutely should have done this one second, without a doubt. Sensors in the safe house indicate that Grizzleface is on the move. I hope Grizzleface is on the move. Because I'm being attacked. Grizzleface, help me! Help me, Grizzleface! Ariel. Yo, Grizzleface, what's up? Let's get this. Let's finally get this friggin' bread. Oh, thank goodness I didn't take you over to any of those bear traps. Solid work, Murray. Now that the oil lines are exposed, Sly's all set up for a paragliding job off the lighthouse. He's done it. Oh, the bear just vanished. Was there ever even a bear to begin with, chat? We may never know. All right. I'm pretty sure we got uh, those three missions there, and then it'll be the final mission of the game after that. Or not the final mission of the game, the final mission of Episode 7, I mean. And then we just have Episode 8. I can't remember how long Episode 8 is, but, you know. I think it's short enough to where we should expect just a two-hour, two-and-a-half-hour stream today. 
I don't think we're going to be going a full three hours. I could be wrong, though. Wait, wait, wait. I should do the... No, 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 no. I should do the slime mission. Do the two slime missions. Sly can get back to the safe house really quick. Then do the Bentley mission to wrap up. To wrap up this set of missions. Then it'll give us another cutscene. Goodbye to you. Let's do that one first, I suppose. Don't mind me, just passing through. Did I just try to spire jump off of something off the edge? What was that? That lighthouse is the conduit for collecting the northern lights. We need to shut it down, or the silo battery will continue to fill with energy making it impossible for us to stow away inside. So, you want me to go in there and bust the thing up? Sounds like work for Murray. Actually, this job will require all three of our skills. The front door is locked, and you're the only one capable of climbing up to the hatch on top. Once inside, sneak down to the ground floor and let us in. We'll help you finish the job. All right, see you on the ground floor. Let's get it. I've already climbed this thing twice, I think. Or at least once. I'm gonna have to climb it a third time to do the other mission. Oh, that was really close. I could have literally died there. Uh... Chat? Did you also see where Sly just, like, went ghost and became intangible and was not hit at all by the thing that clearly hit him? there was a cheer there. It was actually a donation. Eli, thank you so much for the donation. Greatly appreciated, and thank you for the kind words as well. Uh, Yeah, I'll, I'll do that. Oh, no. I'm amazing. Little tippy taps. Little tiptoe taps. Why are there so many spotlights? Oh, dear. I'm um, never... Why do I even worry? The camera? Thank you. Oh, yeah, look at this. The ultimate lock. Who could ever overcome it? Just let me at that northern light attractor. It'll be slag in minutes. Not quite that simple, Murray. I'll reverse the energy flow from the control computer while you lift the main circuit breaker. That should give Sly a short window of opportunity to climb up the power lines and overload the system from the top. Up, down, up, down. They should put an elevator in this place. I agree. You know what? You don't deserve these. I've just realized that an enemy spawned as a result of this. So, you know, not my best plan ever, but what else is new? Goodbye. Where do you guys keep coming from? All right, back to the top we go. Nothing could possibly go wrong. Don't talk to me. We can't keep this thing reversed forever. Yeah, this is heavier than it looks. Is it though? Is it really though? Oh no, you don't. I'm too clever for that. Yeah, okay, you know what? Well played, well played. You got me. This is fine. Everything is fine. In fact, some might even say everything is awesome. I, I did it? <laughs> okay, sick, it worked. We did it. The collection mechanism is overloading. Overloading. 
Oh, that's the end of that mission. I thought there was more.